Um, despite the challenging investment environment, uh, we believe that private, private markets will still outperform public markets due to their structural advantages, such as majority ownership, a long-term horizon, and a focus on operational value creation, which will ultimately drive returns in the future. Uh, versus previous years, we see more opportunities for relative value implementation and tactical asset allocation within multi-asset portfolios. Over the last 10 years, we had a benign environment where equity, be that private equity, but also public equity, was the clear winner. With rising interest rates and rising inflation, we believe uh, we, have, we see more opportunities in other asset classes such as private debt, but also some select uh, real assets. In terms of portfolio construction, we advocate three things to our clients. Number one is diversification. Stay diversified in terms of asset class, region, instrument, uh, but also importantly vintage year, where we advocate minimum three-year build-up periods for new portfolios. Number two is flexibility. Expand the investment guidelines to include new asset classes, regions, opportunistic strategies, and also work with wide bandwidths around your strategic asset allocation because this will allow for a better implementation of relative value and it will ultimately enhance returns. Last but not least is maintain enough dry powder and liquidity. Challenging times bring investment opportunities, as we heard, Stefan, but it's important to have the dry powder to be able to capitalize on those opportunities.